Hello everybody, today we're going to be looking at another Goodwill reseller haul, so let's get right into it. And welcome back. If you're new to my channel, I'm Charles, and along with my wife Angelique, I run a closet on Poshmark. It's called The Deacons. Um, so links will be in the description. Go ahead and check it out. All right, now I did say this was a Goodwill or the a reseller haul. This is a reseller box, and like on all the reseller boxes we've gotten recently, my wife was able to see everything in it before she ordered it. She's already gone through it, and um, she knew what was in it. I did not know what was in it until I shot it, and then I think all this stuff's been listed by now. So. Um, if you do like anything, it'll be up in the closet. All right. Up first, we have a pair of rag and bone jeans. Uh, these are size 27 jeggings. Okay, so they're not technically jeans, they're a jegging. Um, and yeah, they are... They're nice. Um, I know I say this all the time, but Ragamone does pretty good for us, so that's why we keep going back to this reseller, because she gives us a lot of rag and bone. And I think... nope. Alright, next we have a J brand. Um, these are... Let's see if I can find a size here. Uh, these are a size 28, and I'm not familiar with J brand, um, but my wife did seem pretty excited um, when she saw it. She said, they're, hey, this reseller never sends us any bad brands, so um, if it was in here, it's probably a good brand, and my wife wouldn't have gotten the box if she thought it had bad brands in it. So. Definitely happy about that. I do know that both of those did fit on the mannequin. Um, so the the jig the the rag and bones the um, jeggings were a little bit tight tight, but because they're jeggings, they have a little stretch. They fit just fine. All right. Um, next we have a clothing obsessed company. Uh, this is if it'll actually focus. There it goes. This is a one size um, vest. Uh, so I guess it's one size fits all, um, and it kind of has a, kind of like a um, faux, like, kind of that little bit of a fuzzy front, and then the back is um, is knit, a little bit see through, um, but it's open. So you would wear this over over something, and it is nice and warm. So I don't know how well that will do going into summer, but. Um, it should do if it should do fine when we get back around to winter. All right, up next, this is something I was excited about because it is Tory Burch. Uh, this is a small, and it is a top. Um, don't know. I don't think those sleeves are short enough to be considered a t-shirt. So it's just a. a sh I guess we'll just call it a shirt. Um, and we did make sure that all of these little jewels, these little. Um, these little beads that are around the neck were there. Um, they appear to all be there. There's not any spots where there's obviously one missing. Uh, so that's good. That's something you always have to check with the um, clothing that has those little beads on it. Uh, we've been burned in the past on a couple of um, things we picked up at on a haul. Um, so it's something we check for now. All right. I think we have just a few more items. I could have swore there were. Okay. Um, up next we have a Dane von Fristenberg. And this is a small um, tank top. Uh, now it does have the um, kind of puffy, the puffy. Um, center there's no now even though like it kind of has the illusion because of just the way the uh, this design is or not, not 
this just kind of the way the fabric looks it makes it look like it might button but it it doesn't there's no buttons no zippers so this is just um yeah, this is just as is all right i think we only have a few more items and then we will be done with this box we only have one more item and we're done with this box okay and the last item is an express xxl sweatshirt sweater now um this this did fool me at first um i wasn't sure because uh, this is a this isn't a hoodie um for someone who has a very weird shaped head this actually is just a it just goes around the neck and keeps your neck nice and warm so you don't have to wear a scarf um and now i didn't see on this um i did notice no no pockets on it um but very long sleeve so i think um i think this is functionally designed to keep you very warm and give you a nice a lot of just a lot of um room to kind of tuck into and just get nice and cozy um so when winter rolls back around this should do very well all right and that brings us to the end of the box so um definitely like the rag and bone always like the rag and bone um liked the j brand um even though i never heard of it um it did look very it did look very very nice when we shot it um it should do it should do very well i'm not super duper happy about the stuff that is more cold weather stuff um just because of the time of the year it is um we are just getting out of um we are just getting out of winter i think the i'm shooting this on the 18th so i believe the 19th might actually be the first day of spring um i'll have to look that up we've we have already sprung forward um in daylight savings time so spring is um very fastly approaching um but other than other than that all the items looked good um so everything should sell just fine and who knows maybe we'll um maybe we'll have a couple people pick up some stuff for later in the year all right if you like this video be sure to like share and subscribe until next time i've been charles and i'll see you